Hello everyone. A set of satellite photos to look at here, taken along the Dnipro River. Some of them aren't great quality, but they are clear enough to show that Russia is amassing a fleet of barges. Let's go through the images and then see where exactly they are. So the first one on screen now is from October the 16th. It's difficult to make out, but it appears that there are two large barges with possibly three small ones in a channel, off the Dnipro River on the eastern bank. This is south of Kherson, but we will get to the geolocation later. This second image is from the 31st of October. It shows more of a build-up of barges. There look to be two more large ones and two small ones. Now it's unclear on this image if these small ones are barges or motorboat tugs which we've seen being used to position and tow them. I think small barges as they look too big to be boats that we've seen being used to tow these around. And as we've seen the final image, that is the case. Here is the third image from the 5th of November. And as we can see here, the number of barges has greatly increased. It's hard to tell how many there are. Some are very close together. So it is hard to tell if it is two barges or one barge with two parts which are different colours in some cases. But on this image, there look to be around 15 barges and boats or more here. But then there's an image from a different uploader from November the 4th which is clearer and shows how many boats and barges there are here and the extent of Russia's build-up. So as we can see here, there are over 20 barges and also floating cranes. These floating barges and cranes are likely stolen from Herson and placed here. So why? This has been a gradual build-up of barges, so I think we can rule out this just being a storage place for Russia's ferries which are used to cross the Dnipro. I also think we can rule out this being a storage place for barges and um, floating cranes which they intend to ship to Russia. Sailing these from Kherson all the way to Russia will leave them as a open target for Ukraine. They won't make it. Much of the word online suggests that these are here preparing for um, the long rumoured evacuation of the western side of the Dnipro. There has been much talk and many signs pointing to a Russian evacuation coming, such as a military build up on the western side of the Dnipro, such as defensive positions being built. Russia stripping Kherson city of anything that isn't bolted down. What is certain, however, is that these are just crying out for a visit from Mr. HIMARS, grouped up together like this. Russia might as well place a sign saying HIMARS me over the top of them. But if things are pointing out to these being evacuation barges, would Ukraine want to hit them with HIMARS? Maybe it's been judged better to let the Russians leave Kherson with their tails between their legs willingly, rather than trapping the soldiers there and giving the Russians little option then to fight. If these are indeed for evacuation, it would be interesting. These are large, slow, plodding targets, and as we've seen, they have no defence against high Mars. I don't think a single high Mars has been downed so far. And now something else interesting. We have only ever seen light vehicles on these barges heading from east to west over the Dnipro. I very much doubt that these are capable of carrying heavy howitzers and tanks. With the Antonovsky Bridge unusable, I think it's very likely that if we do see a mass retreat over the Dnipro, we could very well see a mass abandonment of whichever heavy vehicles are still there. Because I just can't see how they are going to get back over. The only real option would be the Nova Kokovka Bridge which has been repaired. And imagine hundreds of tanks, BMPs, howitzers trying to cross that at the same time. The logjam would be a prime target for everything which can be thrown at them basically. So I definitely think if the retreat does happen all the heavy vehicles are going to be abandoned. Before we finish, here's the location on Google Maps. So you can see it's south of Herson City and the Antonovsky Bridge. So that's it for this video. I thought it definitely worth taking a look at. It will be interesting to see if we do see a um, mass retreat. If you found the video interesting, please click like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Thanks again and take care everybody.